Yo, what's up guys, Kevin here. Another day riding at the High Cascade Snowboard Camp. We've got some really nice medium sized jumps over there that I'm working on some back threes with mute grabs. TJ is up here as well, putting together a board review on the Arbor Formula. Let's go ride some park, get this trick down. Okay guys, so we're at the top of the park and we've got two nice jumps down here. So I'm going for the back three with the mute grab. Three things I'm thinking about. One, get a clean line in so I can get that straight pop off my toes. Creating that rotation so I can get the 180 around, reach down with my front hand, get the grab, and spot my landing. That felt super good. But yeah, I was just really focusing on getting that level pop, reaching for the grab, creating that spin. It all came together. I think I just need a little bit more time in the air and a little bit more commitment on the grab and it'll come together clean. All right, guys, back at the top of the high cascade lane here. So for this line, I'm gonna be zigzagging across the whole park, uh, trying to get a front board on El Toro, probably my favorite rail in the park right now. Uh, and then just hit some tranny, going for a back three, hand plant. And if I'm feeling it, maybe get upside down on that last hip. Woo! So going for that jump line again, this time a little bit more speed, a little more pop, commit to that grab, ride it out, let's go. Oh yeah, sweet, yeah, it's feeling really good. Just need to put more mileage on it to get more comfortable and more air. I was talking to some other campers here as well that are working on similar tricks. And I feel like the biggest thing is just patience and committing, you know, progressing each time you go for something, getting the feel for it and sticking with it until you got it dialed in. It's feeling good. Shout out to the pro, uh, snowboard pro camp guys uh, all the way from Philly at High Cascade Snowboard Camp. Sweet. Woo. Lap two. Gonna hit the same line Kevin's been going on. It looks like it's a lot of fun. Uh, you're just gonna go for a nose press, try to feel out the flex of this snowboard, and then maybe a back three and a front three. We'll see how it goes. TJ, you got any tips for threes with grabs? Yeah, I think the biggest thing that helps me personally is initiating the rotation and making sure you're gonna get the spin you wanna do before you go to the grab. So usually wait until you get a 180 before you get that grab. Cool. I'm from Shannon Peter. Hello. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. It's <laughs> really a nice day. <laughs> TJ, what are you waiting for? Five seconds. I got Lil John alive coming on. All right, you ready?
still not enough speed, but I had to try it at least once. Oh, felt so good. It was all that training ahead of time, going to bounce, getting on the snowboard addiction training board, getting those spins, getting comfortable, progressing slowly up here in the snow. Felt good for everything to come together. Nice, man. You. Thank you. How's the weather out here, Garrett? Oh, it's phenomenal. It's looking great out here, boys. Anything else to say about this weather? It's nice out. Shout out Matt Miniachi. Yeah, you got me to do it. Uh, why'd you do that? Ah, shout out. What's up, Spitter again? <laughs> TJ was so close in that one. He's got it tomorrow. All right, let's ride out. Great day up there today, guys. Day two up with High Cascade. Super stoked on getting those back threes with the grabs. If you guys have any questions, definitely leave them down in the comments. Also, look out for TJ's next board review. What do you got going for us? We got the Arbor Formula coming up soon. Super stoked to share it with you guys. It's gonna be a fun one. Thanks for watching, guys. Have fun out there, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. Yo! I don't the phone numbers, I don't know. Mm. Gonna film some bureau. Talk about some good audio. I know. <laughs>